lot of people, they want to scratch a cow on her head like a puppy dog. Cows do not like to be scratched on the head. They're either, if a cow's pushing on another cow's head, they're either trying to fight or they are, they're play fighting sometimes, but a cow's head is really not designed to be scratched. And you can see, man, you scratch them right here, right next to that tail head, either side, or you get you a curry comb and uh, scratch right underneath the tail. And you want to move that curry comb. That curry comb is, uh, it can hurt them if you scratch the same place too long, but I mean, everywhere in here, they're just, they really like that. It's just like giving them a back massage. Right up there next to that tail head. And she'll move her whole body. You can kind of, it's hard to see in this light, but. And then she gets her, gets her tongue out like that. She is at the spa. This is probably the best place to scratch a cow. And uh, you can get kicked doing it. So a helpful tip. If you've got a gentle cow, you probably already know this. But uh, if you got a cow that's kind of questionable, you can start with a stick or a little hand rake or something just to give you enough room to get out of the way. But uh, if you're feeding hay in the winter time or that cow's got her head down doing something and she's of a temperament that you want to try it just get out of here she, they're gentle they'll normally tell you before they kick you they normally give you a warning um, you know and just kind of start scratching on her the other place is right up between their shoulder blades that's another really good place it's safe and uh, they really like that right between their shoulder blades but uh, dude, they're, they're not puppy dogs. Don't scratch them on the head. They sure don't like that. And with cows, you can get away with it. But with bulls, it's especially dangerous because they will, uh, they'll want to fight you or they'll want to play with you. In either way, a big bull, 2,000 pounds, uh, you know, they could flip over a small car. <laughs> they'd, uh, they'd pick you up and throw you around. And even a gentle bull that's just playing... I mean, you know, they give you a good hard whack and you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. They're going to really hurt you. Uh, and you're not expecting it from a gentle bull. So anyway, that's my advice for the day. Scratch them on the butt, scratch them between the shoulder blades, but don't treat them like a puppy dog. They're not, and they'll hurt you.